Right now at 4.30, a consumer justice alert about a Dallas-based medical supply company. Kristen Severance found a long list of complaints with very little resolution. More than 150 people have complained to the Dallas BBB about DSM medical supply. But the company says hackers and an ex-employee are to blame for the issues. She has two walkers. She has to walk with a walker. Bob Kellogg ordered a TENSE device for his wife after their physical therapist recommended the product and company. He said, the last time I got, I got one from, from DSM Supply, he said you can get online, check it out. He paid $126. Two months and eight calls to the company later. I said, what happened to my order? It never showed up. She said, well, you quit calling me. I'm getting sick and tired of this. I can't get my work done. And I said, say again? He said, that's right, I can't get my work done. He's been waiting since May of 2016. So I said, this is ridiculous, and so I called the Better Business Bureau. DSM has an F rating with the Dallas BBB after 154 people complained about the company. And when they try and reach out to the company to either get a refund or get their supplies, either they're never delivered or they're delivered, you know, way past the, the usage date. The BBB says DSM hasn't responded to 121 of those complaints. They have to be doing this intentionally. There's no reason that you could say that they are doing it just by stupidity or bad management. I mean, you can't be that bad. The owner of DSM says it's not their fault. He told me their systems got attacked by ransomware last March, and an employee quit last summer and deleted years' worth of customer information. But according to the BBB, people have been complaining about this company for years. We've seen similar complaints happen for the last three years, going all the way back to 2014. Uh, so it's not a new occurrence, and they're still coming in. Kellogg says the worst part was seeing his wife's back get worse, waiting for the product he paid for that may have helped. DSM's owner told me they would reach out to Kellogg and give him a refund. Kellogg was also contacted by an investigator with the Attorney General's office, although the AG's office won't confirm or deny an open investigation. We'll keep you posted. I'm consumer justice investigator Kristen Severance, CBS 11 News. And if you need consumer justice, be sure to call Kristen right now. The number there on your screen, 817-586-7211. You can also email her at consumerjustice at ktvt.com.